three Cold War policies of the United States that you need to know if you're a push exam. First, defense policy. And the big one here is the containment policy. First articulated by diplomat George Kennan, the containment policy recognized that Soviet communism wanted to take over the whole dang world. So instead of trying to eradicate communism, the United States would simply seek to contain it where it already existed. No spreadsies for you, Stalin. You should know that this policy was first applied in the Truman Doctrine in which the US provided financial aid to Greece and Turkey to help them fend off communist pressure. And it was also what created the occasion for the creation of NATO, which was a mutual defense pact among Western nations. Second, economic policy. In order to keep the Soviets from taking over Western Europe, the U.S. implemented the Marshall Plan, which sent $13 billion in aid to help Western Europe rebuild after World War II. Third, weapons policy. Now, although the U.S. and Soviet Union never fought each other directly in the Cold War, still, they stockpiled metric buttloads of weapons, starting with atomic bombs and then into hydrogen bombs, all the way through Reagan's strategic defense initiative, which included proposals, I kid you not, for space lasers to blow the Soviet Union's crap up. So remember those, use them in your essays, and that's 